everyone welcome or welcome back to my youtube channel my name is jess and today i thought I'd do a little video on my sunglass collection so i just recently got a new pair and i thought well hey that would be a really good idea for a video to show you guys kind of what styles i like what brands i like and basically just like i said just like my collection of what i currently have I recently have sold a few um, pieces and I have a few pieces listed on my Poshmark. Um, so definitely check out my Poshmark. I'll link it down below in the description because I've been kind of doing like a whole closet clean out of like all my stuff because I'm constantly getting new things. So it's like I really need to start getting rid of some stuff. So definitely check out my Poshmark. But I thought I'd show you like what I have. Um, I have a range of I guess you could say these are mostly like designer sunglasses so higher end to like lower end designer um sunglasses that i have um i'll show you guys first the new pair because i love them so much and i've been seeing kind of like this style around on different people and i'm like well i wanted to try it and see what it was like so they are a pair of Prada ones so I keep all my cases all the little cloths everything that comes like with the sunglasses when you get them I just like to keep it just in case I do end up selling stuff so that'd be a nice little bonus when you're ordering something for me that you're gonna get the case and everything so these are a pair of Prada ones that I just recently got from the real real so I've been shopping on the Real Real. This is like my second per purchase from the Real Real. And they have, if you're not familiar with them, designer pieces that are basically um, pre owned, you know, pre owned, pre loved. And you can go on there and shop like a wide variety of designers and everything. So I like to look on there at their sunglasses because I love sunglasses in general that's probably like my favorite accessory so got this pair from there like i said they're prada and they are the um it's more of a newer style because i looked and this style is still on like the prada website so it's like a more um kind of square but more kind of like a little bit of a cat eye and then on the back it has like you can see them there the prada logo like on the arms and the lenses are more of like a brown brown greenish almost yellow but i'll try them on i'll try all these on just to show you guys how they look on me but they are a little bit bigger of a style and then they are they're black i'll kind of show you but then they have like a green like yellow marbling i don't know if this is gonna focus i have trouble with this camera for some reason it just doesn't like to focus there you go you can kind of see it on the front but i just thought they were cool so they're black and then have that marbling something different and that's kind of like what i like to go for when i get sunglasses a little bit different a little bit out there a little bit like hey i'm gonna get noticed because that's kind of like what i like so um i'll put them on but they like i said they're bigger a little bit bigger and it has that, like I said, that style on the side. Like I've been seeing that like everywhere on the new, all the new like Prada sunglasses have like this style of arm, but I just thought they look like so good. So these are the newest and I just got them this past Tuesday. So I've been wearing them like every day. Um, just cause I'm obsessed with them cause they just look so good and so most of the styles of the sunglasses I have are kind of bigger, but different shapes. So this would be more of on, I'm going to show you like all the higher end designer ones and then we'll go down to like the lower end, like Ray-Ban and Maui Jim. Um, but so going to be wearing these like all the time. That's usually what I get. Like I'll usually get, this is my second pair of sunglasses that I got this past summer. So I usually always get like one new pair 
for summer every year. And then I kind of like to go through, like I said, kind of go through, see what ones I'm actually wearing, and then I'll list them on my Poshmark. But these are definitely not going on there for a while. So um, got these for way less than half on there because I think retail I saw on the Prada website was like $530 and I got them for $265 on the Real Real. So really great, love these. Really kind of like a standout piece, like I said, which I love. And nice little case that they go. It didn't come with the cloth, but that's okay. Um, Cause I have, if you don't know this about me, cause I don't think I've ever said like where I work, I actually work at an eye doctor's office. So I have like all the cleaning sprays. I know what um, cleaning cloths, tissues, all that stuff to use. So I try to keep all my stuff like really nice, clean. And which is really, I don't know, just something, just a little fun fact, I guess I'll throw in there. That's where I work is an eye doctor's office. So. Um, I'm kind of around like sunglasses, glasses and stuff like all day long. So kind of learned a few things from working there just to kind of keep things clean and just protected and everything like that. So uh, then I'll go in with, I guess I'll show you my other Prada pair that I have. I haven't really worn these ones in a while. Same case. I think I got these from Sunglass Hut, but they are more of a rounder style and a little bit of a point still different so they're like round and then this part right here you guys can see is like open and then just has like arms and with the nose pieces i am not really a fan of the nose pieces because when i put them up i like to put my sunglasses up on my head if we're, we're going inside somewhere and they always get stuck in my hair so most of the pairs I have don't have nose pieces. I just, I don't care for them. So I usually go with more of a plastic frame without the nose pieces. So, but I'll try them on, show you guys. They have like gray lenses that are like gradient. So they're like darker down the lighter, but still really cool. Still really in, I think. I don't think any of these pairs I have go out of style. I know they always are coming out with new stuff, but these ones I feel like are still like in and cool and still different. Like, cause when you sit back here and look, it's like, you can see it goes from the darker to like almost like a clear lens, but I really like these too. And they just have like a silver arm and they just have like the little Prada logo here and up in the corner, like right on this lens there so but yeah really like these two like I said I got them at sunglass hut I've seen this pair on the real real not too long ago so I'm like I don't really want to get rid of them yet I'll still kind of keep them in the mix for a while but I like them too as well like I said I got them from sunglass hut that was been back in 2017 when I got married because I took some photos in these and so it's been a while for those but like I said they still have the same case so not really too far off I guess and then we'll go in with the other new pair I got this year which I showed this in my one of my other videos I got these for my birthday this year and they are from also the Rio Rio but from the brand Saint Laurent and they are more of a square um, sunglass and they are in yellow with almost like a red pink lens and really like this style to see this more square smaller a lot lately too but they kind of like point up I don't know I just really like them because they're different I haven't seen anybody with these ones um, but I've seen them other colors on the real real I really wanted to get the ones that were black and then had the yellow lenses. But then I saw everybody had those. I'm like, no, I want to get something a little bit different. So they are just, like I said, more square. And it just says Saint Laurent on the side here. And I just think they're really cool too. Different. You can see them, like I said, like they're yellow with like pink red lenses. So got them very affordable on the real real too. I think they still have this style on the St. Laurent website 
in just like other colors. I haven't seen this one as like new. So came in, like I said, really nice little case. And I just keep it in there just to protect them all. But then we'll go in with more of still higher end. This is probably the most expensive pair of sunglasses I have um, compared to all of these ones I'm going to show you guys because I actually paid full price for these ones. But they are a pair of Chanel ones. Comes in this nice little quilted leather case. And these are more of a, they call them like a shield sunglass, but they are like a bigger black with the nude color little Chanel logo right there on the side. And then it says Chanel across the top. I think you guys can see it there. Yeah. But really like these ones. I wear these a lot too. They're like a square but more like shield like so but yeah thicker arms too and the lenses are like black so you really can't see my eyes but really like that it has that Chanel logo on the top I don't think they have these ones on their site anymore because I was looking at their site this this year to see what newer sunglasses were out and I don't remember seeing these ones but these are like really cool I think and if you don't want anybody to know you, like a lot of these sun, like these ones and those Prada ones are like big enough that <laughs> like they cover your face. So, but I just, I love these ones too. I wear these ones a lot as well, but I think I paid for these. These were like a pair that were over 500 for these. So way more than I would really spend. This was more of like a splurgy thing that I got these a couple summers ago and wouldn't be something I'd spend like on an everyday um, basis for a pair. So that's why, like I said, I like looking on the real real because I can find ones that are still in really good condition and it tells you on there like what the condition is of them. Um, so that is really helpful too because I like to get ones that are like in pristine condition like hardly worn just so they're like like brand new that's what I like so then I'll show you a pair I got um from basically like I said I work at the eye doctor's office and we carry Maui gyms there and we actually won I think it was last year some sort of contact contest they were having and I got a gift card for a pair of Maui gems that you could get free that was like any pair you wanted you could get so I think it was non-prescription so I got a pair that were more in the they came out with like a more of a fashion line because I particularly don't really like Maui gems and there are some people that really love them I sold a pair of ones that I got when I first started working there on the real real. I wore them a little bit, but they're just, I don't know. I like more of like higher end designer name that I know. And I know a lot of people like these, but I don't know. I just don't really, they're nice, but I don't know if I really like them that well. So who knows, this might be a pair that I end up selling on the real, or the, um, on Poshmark. So. If you're interested and you watch this video, I might be listing them. So just, they are just more, they're again, more of like a designer, almost look like a pair of Saint Laurent style. That's why I got this. And more cat eye pointed, nice, I don't know. They're nice too, but I just feel like they're just, I don't know. They're cool, but just not like out there enough, I guess, for me. I don't know. I like them. I've only worn them a few times, but I may, like I said, sell them. Just nice, like black, um, nice black lenses, and then just on the side says Maui Gym and everything. But I don't know. Just not really my cup of tea um, with a lot of the ones that they have and stuff. But. But yeah, say I have the case, I have um, clean cloth in there, so I might might have to sell them ones because 
they're not ones that I'm gonna gravitate towards to go grab out of these other ones that I've showed you guys so then the last three pairs are Ray-Ban because at one point Ray-Ban was like the only sunglasses I would get and so these are like the last three pairs that I have because I've sold a bunch like I said on Poshmark and I have the classic Wayfair ones but they're actually the folding ones which are really cool and I wear these two from time to time just like a nice basic black sunglass so love them like that they're folding um because I got them like as soon as they came out that style of that like I said that fold but my husband has a pair of foldable Burberry ones I love them um really cool too but yeah that just kind of go like that and then just goes into a little tiny box which is really cool too so really cool for I don't know great like storage like if you don't want to have like a huge case because that's it's hard with like some of these ones for me to just carry around a case um half the time I'll leave it in the car and don't ever leave like your actual sunglasses in the car in the heat because they're probably going to get all heat altered and warped and so that there's a fun fact don't do that that's something i learned and last couple pairs these ones these two pairs are going to have nose pieces um so this is a pair of ray-ban polarized ones because it has the little p in the corner with um almost like an aviator but they're more round it has that like two double bars there but just another different I really like these ones too I haven't worn them in a while but they're like big and just kind of like a retro style look see me just has like a nice really thin arm metal arm but like these two I got these um when we went on our honeymoon before it I bought this pair and that Prada pair so two like brown pairs but these are cool too I haven't worn these in a while so I might have to get this back out into the mix because these I don't know they look good too so um I think that style is still available I think the Wayfair ones are don't know if they are in the foldable and then the last pair is a final Ray-Ban they are like another retro kind of almost like um hexagonal kind of but like these ones too they're gold so a little bit different but still the like the black black green lenses because these are more of like a green lens and they're like the flat flat lens so just something a little bit different too almost like an aviator um but not but I really like these ones too as well just haven't worn them in a while because like I said I've been more wearing the Saint Laurent and the Prada ones are like my go-to right now so I just thought it'd be a fun little video to show you guys kind of like what styles I like and brands I like of sunglasses I'm always looking at that type of stuff so um, if I get any new ones I'll probably have to do a little updated sunglass collection but Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please be sure to subscribe here to my channel because I'm really trying hard, making an effort, posting every week and being on here and being on my Instagram. Also, if you haven't followed me on Instagram, at Jessica McAfoo, so I'll put it on the screen. But just trying to be on here and trying to make this as like, my full-time job eventually I really like to get monetized so I can start making money on here I'm getting views slowly getting subscribers but I'm really trying to be on here every week posting getting videos up and making it happen so um, like I said please be sure to subscribe here to my channel follow me on Instagram at Jessica McAfoos and we will see you guys in the next video Bye now. <laughs>